Hi everyone and welcome back. I have this package here from Journal Station. I've never purchased from them before and such cute things attached to this box. Look at this part here, so cute. So I'm gonna preserve those bits and pieces, but I'll do that later. I'm just going to get right into it. Okay, once we get inside, we have this uh, journalstation.net uh, tape over it. So that's the website you can go to. And let's see. So I was on Instagram. Oh, one more. Of course, where else would I be? And I saw some stamps that she had stopped. So I was keen to have a look at those. Oh, many thanks. Very cute. Uh, yeah, so I decided to have a look in the store. I think there's only one of the stamps left that I was looking for. That's okay. I don't need all the stamps. You know, I get so many of them and yeah, how many can we actually use? But um, I love them. So, so many cute things here for me to stick in my journal. Thanks so much for stopping by, Desley. Enjoy these beautiful stationeries. Oh, so cute. Little sticker on here. Thank you, Claire. So on the front, we have this cute little Polaroid with lots of goodies. Is that my order? I think that's my order. How cute is that? Oh my goodness. And then we have these little stickers. I feel I enjoy, I record, stars, sound of writing, myself, stationary life is happy life, my happiness. Oh, those are cute. Oh, I really like that. That's such a cute idea. And of course, I love the smiley face so much. Okay, so first up in here is this stamp. And it is from Pens Papers Planner is the name of the uh, designer. Or the shop, I should say. And it says... It's okay to be a little obsessed with stationery. It's so pretty. Look at this beautiful rubber stamp. Love it. Very cute. Thank you. What else do we have here? So I have a little packet. Look at this. It's so cute. So obviously that's going to go in straight as is into my journal. What I might do is just cut the top off of this. And hope I don't cut anything important. I love this so much. That is beautiful. Thank you. That's going... I might use this even as a cover for a journal in next year. Hmm. Okay, I'll think about that. All right, so first up, it's this random collection of things that I got. I got these little lace stickers that are cute little flowers. Can you see? I'll just take them out of the plastic. I'll just take one out. It's got a teeny tiny little bit of sticker on the back there. And then here is the beautiful little lace flower. They had, uh, she had a lot of different types and sizes, um, but I just thought I'd try these ones first. They're really sweet. Ah, oh, I love them. I'm kind of not sure how I'm going to use these, um, but I definitely want to use them in a collage kind of way. So stay right. tuned. Stay tuned for that. All right, next up I have these. Oh my goodness. <laughs> um, these super cute egg stickers. It's a shop called Kami Kami, Kami Kami Chop. And look how cute these are. This one's wearing a little egg as a hat and she's got an eggy dress and we've got eggs here with dumplings we've got an egg walking along as your best friend I had eggs for lunch today and I feel bad about it now because these are so cute no I'm kidding oh uh, they're adorable oh I love them so much um you know it's funny when you're shopping from Australia the shipping is always pretty pricey um coming from the US not always the US or Canada but um, so, you know, I don't buy too many things. I just buy a few things here and there, mainly to try at the shop, make sure everything's okay. Um, and yeah, I'm so glad I got these. They're super, super cute. Really lovely. Oh, 
so much fun. Okay, so next up is four of the same thing, sort of same thing, not exactly the same. And these are words. A this is called A Collection of Words in the Moonlight. And uh, I got the four different colours. You can see here, one, two, three, four. And the first colour colorway is this kind of beige. But if you see here, the you'll see in a minute, the words are different on every sheet. So um, there is nothing more truly artistic than to love people across here in the middle. You're made of flowers, cherish every moment. I'm always looking for little phrase stickers because I do really love phrase stickers and I like to use them sort of as part of journaling uh, to just uh, highlight a moment or whatever. So that's why I got all four of them. So that's the um, neutral set. Then we've got, I mean, they're, very, they're fairly neutral as well. We've just got the blue brought in along with the um, br the brown and grey. So you can see those colours all go really nicely together. This one, the longer phrase says, life can't always be good and life can't always be bad. That's very good. Sunshine comes to all who feel rain. Mindfulness. Um, we are all broken. That's how the light gets in. Lots of really just lovely little phrases on these stickers here so that's the bluish bluish set and set three has some pink so the long quote here if you truly love nature you will find beauty everywhere and this one we have some black and some pink as well as the white so i think those are really lovely i'm very excited to use these and the last one we have the neutral again with the green we don't have a super long quote across the centre here like we did on the others, but we do have this one that says things that make you feel happy to be alive. We've got trust the magic of new beginnings. I just really like them. I've, I've always, you probably know if you've been here a while, but I love words. I really love words. I'm a very wordy person. <laughs> um, so I like having words around me. Um, so I'm very excited to have these for journaling in the future. I was going to say in 2024, but I probably should use them now, right? Okay, next up are these dots. I wasn't really sure what these were exactly, except that they were circles. So let's get them out of the packet and have a look. I think they're identical, but I'm not 100% sure about that. Oh, that's right. They are different sizes. So we've got these big circles here, these little circles here, and these other little circles here. Are they the same or different? And these two are different from each other. And then I bought a second pack. I'll just see if they're exactly the same or not. I can't, I can't be sure whether they were different colors or not. No, they look like the same. I just wasn't sure sort of how many there would be. Yeah, they're the same. So they're bright, but they also had different, I was going to say flavours, but that's not the right word, is it? They had different, um, this looks different to the, that one. Looks like a slightly different colourway. Yeah, I can't really match those up. So it looks like those are different. The big ones are the same, but then these are all a bit different. But still, all the colours are represented. So... Um, just back on that white background, you can see these pretty colours here. And then this one. They are transparent. So you'll be able to see whatever through them. And they're quite small. If you can see that tiny circle inside the bigger circle there, they're quite small. So they'll be good for the Hobonichis. So that's all of those. And then last up is one more thing. I got this set of uh, transfer stickers. These are from the designer Black Milk Project. You know I love Black Milk Project. I use her stickers and washi quite a bit. And stamps as well. So the backing sheet has this cute little pattern at the top and also tells you how to use them, which is unusual. Most people don't tell you how to use them. So two separate sheets here. They're different. Uh, it's called Moments, like I said. And we've got some beautiful colours in here. So we've got these yellows and purples, but then these pinks and blues. 
moments of joy all we have is now uh, moments of joy again there just moments we've got space to write something here and just these girls i just love their hair how it incorporates leaves and things and always wind in some way like it's showing some kind of movement so they are beautiful those are stickers those are paper stickers and then these ones are transfer stickers. So you can see they've got a backing on them there. So different, but... Ah, so they're quite similar, but they're a teeny bit smaller. You see these two yellow ones at the bottom here lining up together. Um, one is a little bit bigger than the other. The paper sticker is a tiny bit bigger than the transfer sticker. And these are glossy because they're a PET kind of... Um, tape sticker so if you didn't know you just place cut out the piece that you want maybe this frame and then lay it on the page and rub that on to the page with with something i i have a little um wooden stick that i use that that's made for this but you can use the end of a pair of tweezers or um even the handle of your scissors to do that and then you end up with these stickers that just melt into your paper beautifully. They cause no bulk. It's so thin. There's virtually no bulk whatsoever in your in your planner or your journal. It's fabulous. Oh, they're beautiful. I love them. What a adorable order. It's a really, really pretty order here of things from Journal Station. I'm just going to lay everything out and we will come back and have a quick look. Okay, so there's everything from Journal Station. I'm obsessed with these egg stickers. They're so cute. And I absolutely love this collage that Claire's done here and this little collection here. That is my order. Oh my goodness, I love that. That that just makes me happy. That must be my order number. What a brilliant idea, Claire. Well done. Love it. And the stationery stamp. It's okay to be a little obsessed with stationery. I mean, I know it is, but it's nice to have validation, isn't it? <laughs> it's such a fun season, isn't it? August, September, October. All of the new planner feels getting ready for 2024. Super excited. Can't wait. Uh, stay tuned if you want to see how I use all these bits and pieces. I may use some now, but I'm probably going to hoard things till January or December when I start setting up. I'm tempted to start setting up early this year because if you've followed me for a while, you know I never get around to it till January, like late January, because Christmas and then I'm away for seeing my family and then work starts, you know, there's so many things to do. But I really think maybe this year I might try to do it a bit earlier. Let's see. Fingers crossed we can do that. And actually, while we're here, I'm just going to journal this little piece here. I'm just going to move all that to the side and I'm going to, and I'm going to just pop this here. This looks like a good spot. I'm going to take this off here. I'll see if I can, I might take this off here and I'd like to use this side. But I'm just gonna cut it down a little so that I can fit it more easily in my A6. Yeah, I'm just gonna paste that in directly as is. I was gonna tip it in, but I think I'm okay with just pasting the whole thing down. I don't really need the back. And I'll put it on this side because it is flatter. And then I'm going to attach my gorgeous little Polaroid as well. Maybe I'll attach it to here. I was going to put it on this side totally separate. But I think actually I'll pop it up here. Let's do it on an angle just for fun. go oh my goodness it's so cute I'm gonna give it another little circle as well while I'm here I'm 
there we go so cute just a little tip in there to show this cute little thank you note i absolutely love that the order is there as well oh my goodness i love it thanks so much claire okay see you soon bye